Hey everybody, Bob Lutz, Paul Sullentrop here in St. Louis in the Cheryl Crow room right behind us. Shockers survived today 66-58. Loyola really had him on the ropes, leading uh, with five minutes left. Built the lead, I believe, to as many as seven points. It looked dire. It looked like NIT was entering the room. And Ron Baker made some huge shots. Shaquille Morris with some huge defensive plays. They get out of here with a first round win in the Valley Tournament. Yeah, you summed it up really well. Uh, you know, they had to win this game, I think, and they did. They didn't pass the eye test for today, and I don't know what that means. So, But I, I'm sure the message the rest of the day will be they need to play a lot better tomorrow. And most likely they will. They look tense. They looked a little bit nervous. They looked, uh, they looked out of sorts. Fred Van Vliet with two early fouls, and whenever he's not on the floor and when he's yeah. not in rhythm, uh, it affects the rest of the team. Yeah, he, the Wichita State had 17 turnovers, which is you know about almost double what you would expect from them. Fred Van Vliet played 20 minutes, and uh, you know those two things are connected. They're just really, you know, they just never get anything going. And part of the credit goes to Loyola. I mean, they're you know good defensive team. They got a lot of athletes. They can give you some problems with what they do. And without Fred out there, it really showed. This team had beaten Loyola handily twice this season. Although I agree with you, Loyola does have athleticism. But Ron Baker really stepped up in the second half, in the second half of the second half, and made some incredible shots when he was bumped, off balance, uh, really had it going. Yeah, he really did, and that was that was nice to see. You know, a guy has played as well as he has over his over his career for him to, you know, you get to St. Louis, you get on this stage, and to really come through, that was great for them. Uh, and I thought Shaq Morris's defense, you know, he blocked the shots, which was kind of spectacular. He also had the one play where he just kind of what they would call walling up and let Devin Turk run into him, didn't draw the foul, and they ended up getting the ball after that possession too. So those two guys were definitely huge in the in the final minutes. Yeah, Shaq, Shaq Morris did not take a shot in this game even, but was a, was a key player on the defensive end, and I don't know if we thought we'd ever say that about Shaquille Morris. Yeah, his shot blocking has really improved, I guess. And, you know, the longer he's in the game, the more he can do those kind of things. Had some foul trouble today. Uh, and was really effective where Anton Grady was not. Uh, Anton had some, you know, definite ball handling turnover problems today, and their depth pays off. Ron Baker, 25 points, leads the Wichita State Shockers. First round Missouri Valley Conference win over Loyola. Back here at the Scott Trade Center tomorrow. We'll talk to you then.